What is up, guys? It is your boy, Frost Shocker, the 96 Hedgehog here, finally with our VBL Week 1 game. It's been a long time waiting for this battle, so, um, yeah, hold on, just let me, uh, reach for my charging station. I was reaching for my charger so I can charge my computer for the battle. And I don't know about you guys, but I have this weird suspicion that my computer, it does okay when there's a computer charger in it. It doesn't, like, lag, pause reconnection, stuff like that when it's not really doing it. I don't know why, but I just have a weird superstition that it does that. I don't know why. But, uh, I'm super excited. We're here for week one where we're taking on Pie Man. And if you guys remember in the past... Pie Man is a rival of mine, back from the GABL days, and back from the BBL as well. I am pretty positive I have never once beaten Pie Man. Pie Man has been one of the players out there that dominates and wants to win by literally as much differential as humanly possible. So, uh, it's going to be a tough matchup for us here. Um, this matchup is going to be a little rough for us. He has really scary things like Scizor. He's got Dragapult. He's got Iron Jugulus. Like, he's got some power. He even has Iron, he has Iron Valiant as well. And I know what you're thinking. Who on the right mind let him get Dragapult plus Iron Valiant? Listen, I had first overall pick. I could have taken the Valiant away from him. But there was a funny penguin. And I wanted to actually legitimately see if this penguin's broken. I legitimately wanted to see if the penguin was broken. But, uh, yeah. So, if you're wondering what kind of team I'm expecting him to bring, uh, I expect him to bring his Dragapult, his Gastrodon, to be able to kind of be a good defensive wall, be a stealth rocker. Now, his Gastrodon is kind of forced to really be either Rocky Helmet, Rindell Berry, Storm, even like things like Storm Dream or Sticky Hold as well. Like he really has a hard time trying to make the best of his Gastrodon. And Gastrodon's gonna be a little annoying. I do think he's gonna bring Rotom Frost as Rotom Frost is very annoying to face off as well. But he has now sent the challenge. Let's go ahead and accept it and see what he brought. Uh, he didn't bring. Wow. He didn't bring Gastro. Wow. He didn't bring his Gastro. Instead, he brought Oricorial for some weird reason. Um, and it's Pom Pom Oriko as well. Now he wishes he did bring it. Oh, wow. Um, I can kind of just... There's no water resist on your team. I'm just thinking with Delibot. As in comes the frost. Wow, I cannot believe he didn't bring that. What? Oh, okay. If if you say so. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm really taken aback by that right now. I'm really tired of taking aback that he did not bring that. All right. Uh, a hydro pump won't kill. Also, I switched my set to U-turn. Could just Hydro Pump here. So I have to be a little careful with my Tsunami now because now he has two electric types. So I do need to be very careful and mindful of that. Yeah, I'm just clicking Hydro. So I did a lot of damage. He's got a trick. Awesome! So it didn't matter. So now, an Ice Beam does hurt him. Now I could just Hydro Pump here again. I'm going to risk getting U-Turn here. Okay, so he's going to U-Turn. So he's going to probably Volt Switch here. I'm going to go into my Mecha Suma. As he will o -wist. Ooh. That was a good play. I didn't think he would Willow us there. That's also such a really weird set, not gonna lie. Uh, I'm just gonna sword dance here, get myself up to neutral.
Is he just gonna go pom pom here? Um, uh, that sucks. My iron hands now. It's at plus two. I really should have put ice punch on this set now. But I felt like I didn't need it, but I probably should have. Plus two and burn. Still kills a Rotom Frost, which is pretty funny. Ori. I don't know. Oh, it's so Pom Pom. Uh, if it's just like max HP, it's still two AKOs. So I'm just gonna Thunder Punch here. He's gonna Air Slash. That did a lot. That did more than I thought it was gonna do. So that's not HP invested. So that does 60 to 71. My dream puncher. Can I air slash me here? And we get rid of the Oracorio. Awesome. So Oracorio's down, which means his shenanigans are gone. Iron Hand's picking up his first KO of the matchup here. He's going to go into Iron Valiant here. I am just going to click play rough here. Or is it stronger to go for... What's more stronger? Thunder Punch and play rough still stronger. So I'm going to play rough here. So he's going to Moonblast me. I think I'm going to die still. Yeah. And so he does not reveal anything to me yet still. All right. So I think I go into my Maleficent here. And I bulk up here. Now, I do need to remember I cannot Terra. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, I'm just gonna bitter blade here. Oh, he had the sneak. He was mixed. I should have sneaked myself. I should have sneaked there. So he's revealed Moonblast, knockoff, Shadow Sneak. Oh, we could be really bad. I think we might just lose to this Valiant. I honestly, God, guys, did not have anything for this Valiant. I really, to the love of God, did not have anything for this Valiant. Which really, really sucks to me right now here. So I'm gonna just quiver here. He's gonna knock off me, which is fine. The sludge bomb here. He's just gonna sack off the Valiant. Okay. Uh, this is still winnable, but wow, that Valiant! I did not expect him to bring Shadow Sink. In comes the Scizor. I'm just gonna Bug Buzz here. He's gonna kill me off a Bullet Punch. We see Life Orb. We do not see Life Orb. I'm going to do this. I'm going to sub right here. He stayed in. Interesting. It's pouncel roll. Okay, come on, game. Scizor offensive if he's this type of set which looks like he might be how much is pounce doing me here um, pounce is looking like a roll to break my sub so i'm just gonna sub here again stop breaking my sub come on what does pounce do again i don't remember is that lower my speed Pounce, yeah, lowers my speed. Wow, those deviants. A plus one Aqua Tail does sixty-two to seventy-three. If I Terra here. It's a roll. I'm gonna Aqua Tail. This is so stupid. But now he doesn't have an Ice Beam switch in. So I'm just gonna Ice Beam here. He's gonna Bullet Punch. Not do much to me. Get rid of the Scizor. Uh, I probably should have just went for the attack, honestly, knowing I did so much to him. In comes the Iron Jugulus. Do I just straight up kill this thing? Because I know he's not Scarf. 
We have uh, Delibot here. I assume straight up KOs him unless he is 100% Yachi Berry. He's not Yachi Berry. That's going to go down. Now, if he goes Rotom here, he's just going to go Pult here. I'm going to go in with Gear Bull here. He's going to tear a dragon. Okay. So, Dragapult, Utility, well, not say Utility, I guess Utility just works. With our Tinglu here, he is now Dragon. Earthquake still does a lot to him. I'm going to Earthquake here. Just follow me, I'm going to Ruination now. So he's Thunderbolt, Willow. And now I think I just sack this, and I think we win. Because unless he's Choice Scarfed, which he's not. Actually, yeah, we just win. Yeah, I think we just win. If he's DD, no, I think we just win. I think we win. Because I'm Choice Scarfed. I outspeed this thing. Unless he's Yachi. If he's Yachi, then he lives. Wait, let me check check this here. If he's Yachi, which probably is what I'm thinking he is now, Iron Bundle's Ice Beam does 62 to 73. It's a roll. Let's go, Iron Bundle! Iron Bundle is stupid. <laughs> Iron Bundle picking up three KOs, baby. Let's go. Oh, my God. I'm not going to lie. I thought I lost that game right there. Oh, my God, dude. I 100% thought I lost that game right there. Oh, man. Whoo. Iron Bundle, baby. Let's go. Delibot coming in the room, baby. Skirt, skirt. <laughs> But, yeah, GG's to Pie Man. I finally beat Pie Man. Let's go. Oh, I'm hyped for that, actually. I'm really hyped that I actually got to fi finally beat him. Oh, now I've, I think, I think it's now just gold. As in Goldoa. And, no, I think it's pretty much just Goldoa. For somewhat rivals I have a long history with. Oh, my God. He baited me with that Yachi Berry. Because here's the thing, if he's Yachi Berry, my Ice Beam only did a maximum of 73%, but he did not. I'm surprised he wouldn't go Yachi Berry if he's going Dragon then. That was such a weird brain then. I don't know. I want to find out his thought process there. But oh my god, we pick up a big victory. It's only a 1-0 victory, so we're not going to start off like super strong, but it's a step in the right direction though. Iron Bundle's totally getting thumbnail, by the way. He just put in the word. But Iron Bundle, he might be broken. He might be broken. He's got kill he's got the most kills so far this season. We're gonna have to see how that works. But yeah, GG's to Pie Man though. He's a great battler. He's one of the top notch players. So the fact that we win, probably a really tough matchup. And to beat one of the best players in the league to start off the season, really is gonna get a good big motivational push for us there. But yeah. GG's to Pie Man again, and thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, share.